Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of crossed ones all set? What? Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. Pity more people can't watch the duels. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning. <laughs> or at least surviving the next... I'll let you know when we're ready. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. So that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Luke. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during... Assignment's all finished. say I was sorry. And you also went on to do the exact same thing. I wouldn't think Black would mind someone telling on someone. Seemed to be his cup of tea. Well, I'd appreciate it not happening again. And then the werewolves joined the goblins in the uprising. Goblins! Werewolves! Where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752! And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what well, I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Oh, fight, fight. It's a bold attack. Was the minister a boot or the minister a flack? Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't give Peeves a smack. She says it's a boot and he says it's a flack. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. He said it was a good drawing a mere moment ago.
I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success. I finished all of the... Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far. But please, mate, I would rather we not end today's lesson with your... Let us begin. And remember, focus... Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Incinerate yourself. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Is everything all right? Yeah. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Mong, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys. And they... You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may... Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope... I hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Urge defending Hogsmeade against Trail. You know, there is such a thing as pride in human hearts. Oi, can you help me? Can't catch 
A Dedalian key. Wonder where it might lead me. There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? Brilliant! An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into it. Brilliant! What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. I do hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. I should see this through and find the Hufflepuff house chest. Family and I travel somewhere every summer. I'm dying to visit Romania. I'd love to see a rabbit. This 
must be my house. Seems I'll need to find more house tokens if I'm to open this. Quite a few by the look of it. matters to me oh you sound offended what did i miss i simply said that it was unusual for a raven claw to have such little wit nothing offensive at all oh i should say one who doesn't find that offensive is clearly lacking intelligence Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hecate. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig! I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. I shall find you when I've completed whatever... Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Sebastian, there you are. There you are. You promised me an explanation for what happened. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. Seems he's working with Ranrock. And Ranrock is after something I found a... Ranrock? And when... Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's... A port key to Gringotts. I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map... You can't be serious. Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. 
Understood. Your secret's safe with me. Whatever it is. Thank you, Sebastian. You mentioned being clever enough not to get... And I am. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. See there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner, so don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light, just as long as you keep your distance and stay cool. You mean... I'll actually be able to turn invisible. Sub. Give it a try.
Ryan's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Sam, you told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. You distract, I get the key. Understood. Someone there? Is that you, Peeves? The key. Good gracious, what a mess! That wasn't so difficult after all. Now, to find that book. Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tome by its cover, I say. Don't let her see you. Should be in the clip. No need for us to be skulking about. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, and so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do Lumos. you think you'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Exploring where they shouldn't be. 
Naughty, naughty, you'll get caught. Peeves, don't you? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. <laughs> oh, blasted Peeves. I've got to stop him, or at least... Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Repair it. Of course. Traces of ancient magic. There must be more to this room. That's it. Lumos. Where might this lead? Lumos. Revelio. Revelio. Not surprising. Guards at the ready.
Revelio. Lumos. This must be the way forward, but to where? <laughs> Nearly there. Best keep my wits about me. Is a book after all.
You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganoff, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs>
You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking... Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section. I want to hear everything. First, let's... Oh. Oh, dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still... I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to us. Why those memories? Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages. Good. Don't neglect your studies. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. Plenty to keep me occupied while... You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well.
Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. What are you up to now? Rebellion.
And this could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revenia. to see you, my friend. Give you some assistance. Hello, can I help? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, my name is Grace Pinch Smedley. I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would ne- You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid. Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need- Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. It sounds dangerous, especially for some... I understand. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last... My best guess is that it's just over there. I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. This must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Hello, Grace. I followed your bear. Oh, how incredible! I did. I hope it makes your father. It will. I can't wait. Thank you so much for doing this for me. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your. Thank you again. And I do hope you keep diving.
You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and all... Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. They attacked you. When I said as much, they turned on me. Struck me till I nearly passed out. To... I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out. That is... Very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here. Just, I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken... It was nice meeting you. <laughs> I wish it had been under better circumstances. After what Van Rock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Orn. Past the ruins. I'm on the right track. An encampment. This must be it. You haven't had much to enjoy. My mother used to make oh, like heads of lettuce, those mushrooms were. <gasps> Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. If he doesn't come round now, he'll be made even more of an example. If only Renrock were here to see this! You're really not very good at this, are you? You can defeat me, do you? <laughs> Why have you not run away? Intend to die, do you? Well, lead 
I'll bury you in the deepest vault. as though you're not even trying. Quite something. Now to Freon's courts. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to Auron.
If you're here for my wares, I'm afraid... I... Arn, I have... I don't, I don't know what to say. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. The ones I faced were determined to make... Oh, I'm glad you're all right. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for you. Perhaps my next piece will be a... What a nice idea, Ron. Oh, I can't wait to get... All the best to you. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my way. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my... They want something that Professor Figgin... When were you at Grin? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form. I... What? I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I would... Everyone has been talking about you def... And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take... What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them dis- Good. Rookwood and Harlow. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operation. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like her? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talk. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit. All right. But I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Be on your guard. Your pardon! How dare you threaten me! What's going on here? <laughs> they must have come this way! Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student! You can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! <laughs> I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. <sighs> we can hold them up. Uh, uh, I'm not going uh, anywhere with you. Uh, uh, uh. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Been so close to Hogwarts. <sighs> I am, thanks in no small part to your ex... Care to tell me why two Ashwinders? Ashwinders? Victor... It's a long story, but...
but... Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting... Best get moving on my research. You're a researcher? Nor it. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? The very same. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know. And I'm studying some curious... Fixtures. These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be... Well, then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important... Com Mallow Sweet? I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol. The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbol. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the mallow suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Protego. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Incendio! Flames make the pyre sink. I take it we can call that a success. We... How does it work? I must review my notes. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on it. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need. My guess is that each will also require mallows, which you can find in Hogsmeade, should you need more. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books.
hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Professor, I completed all of... Well done. Then you're ready to learn. Pay close attention. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. End of the stick. Keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Everyone seems to fear this little shark. Oh. Quite a few hamlets outside. How of many times must I tell you? We are a I I could just have a bottle of beer and three broomsticks Not right now. Have a chat. Thomas Brown. Apparently 
Baron Reed was having a bit of a poker problem. Beatrice Quinton from Dobby. Isn't Sebastian Sally planning to sell it? I really have made it's a mess of it. Is everything... Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm. My arms get so tired carrying them around. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally... Oh, that sounds brilliant. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charm... Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write perhaps you could get them for me. I suppose I could help, if I have the... Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it... If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the... Life seems rather dull in the house. Rebellion. 